Okay, one outboard down, one to go. Uh, this one, this is my the main one for my boat. I need to take the um, prop off for of this guy. I already changed the top seals, so I'll just go ahead and uh, hopefully pop out those other two seals the same way as my Craigslist outdrive. Okay, get the prop off of my outdrive. Fending seals are down there. Uh, I call it off drive. I mean, lower unit. I used to have an eye on There's my Craigslist lower unit kind of draining. I'm uh, draining that penetrating oil out so it doesn't mix with my gear oil once I fill it up. Okay, try drilling the hose. I skipped uh, the cutting the rubber away this time because I really didn't really do it on the bottom seal and it worked fine, so I'm just going to go straight ahead and drill. Still want to pull the bit away though. Okay, I'm going to go for that second seal. Okay, I got some longer screws. The number six is you know, long enough, so it's on number eight, so hopefully, hopefully it'll work. more milky stuff in there. Bring the camera over for a look. Yeah, the Craigslist one definitely didn't have this milky stuff inside. Okay, definitely a little more plaque in this one. I'll put some paper towel down at the bottom and I'm going to try to scrape it out before I put the new seals in. And just clean it all out with the rag, blow it out, spray it out, and install the new seals. Okay, getting ready to put the seals in. This is uh, my original lower unit, and there's a little bit of pitting and corrosion in there uh, around the outside of the bearing housing. So I'm going to use a uh, gasket sealer and uh, hope that does the trick. Okay, 
Okay, I put the seal in now, the first one. I coated it with uh, a uh, gasket, aviation gasket, sealant thing. Hoping that will take care of some of those kind of grooves. Just kind of pushing it in. Get the second one. All right, I got to get something to push that down a little further. Okay, I got a piece of that I left over from the job, so we'll just tap this. Okay, I gave it a few more taps with the hammer. And, uh, you know, it's done there, seated pretty well. Now that I see how far in the uh, seal is, I think that most of the pitting was actually outside the seal surface. So I should be good to go. I'll give it a compressed air test and see what happens. Okay, moment of truth here. Plug my little air checker back in, my pressurizer, get 10 psi, set up my compressor. Don't hear anything. <clears throat> Put a little soapy water in the bottle, see if I see any bubble in action. Nothing there. there at the bottom no bubbles and no bubbles the green's a little bit of grease so I'm good to go say $300 maybe okay now I've got my lower unit number two the crates this unit this time I'm gonna smear it with, with this stuff and put them in one at a time. I think it'll be a little easier to get them in. Let's just put a little bit of this stuff around the outside. Get my trusty piece of pipe. Good to go.